Hello there, this is Jay from JCAD. I make AutoCAD tutorials for students and professionals in the fields of architecture and interior design. In this video, I will be talking about how to fix the interface if you have, if you have a messy situation like I have here, where by mistake I moved these commands and now they're out of, out of line in the ribbon. Um, the fix would be, the, the, the hard way to do it is to actually re-put everything back in place by uh, putting the cursor on the uh, on the collection of the commands for example the modify commands here and when you do that you will see on the left corner here you can see that there's a, a grab bar here if you click and hold to it you're able to move this menu and then what you want to do is go up to the to the um, to the ribbon here and drop it here and you see it will get docked in there I'm gonna do the same with annotation and I'm gonna dock it back in here, the same, and the same with the block. Now here you might have the issue that you might not arrange everything properly as they were originally. Uh, and even if you didn't have this exact situation, maybe you had something uh, that looks a little different, something, I don't know, like this, or you're not sure why the interface looks different and you're not sure what the fix is, um, the easy way to go around this is to actually uh, click on the start button on your computer and then go down to find your uh, AutoCAD software folder uh, Since it starts with a it should be on the very top of the list here And then I'm gonna click on AutoCAD LT 2020 That's the one we're using right now in this tutorial and I'm gonna go down here till I find Reset settings to default and I'm gonna click on this one right now Actually better close AutoCAD first. Let's close AutoCAD before we click it. I'm gonna say no you might think that closing AutoCAD will fix the interface issue and how it looks wrong. It doesn't actually. The all the all the uh, menus that got displaced are actually going to remain there, as you can see here. So again, I'm going to close AutoCAD. I just wanted to show that, and I'm going to go again to the Start menu, find the folder for the current AutoCAD version I'm using. I'm going to click here on this arrow, then go down till you find Reset Settings to Default and click on it and it will ask you if you'd like to back up um, and reset custom settings um, um, this option is for anybody who is really customizing their interface uh, or doing any other customization if you are a beginner and you're not sure what this means you don't need to do this uh, for the people who know who know about custom settings in AutoCAD they can go ahead and back up their settings but for the beginners what you would do you would click on reset custom settings right now and it will say that the original settings has been successfully reset and click OK and right now it will quickly uh, reinstall uh, or reset pretty much AutoCAD and it will open the software again and as you can see the menus that got displaced they got they disappeared and I'm gonna click on start drawing here and you can see everything went back to their original or default location. Alright, and that was it for this video.